New at six, three San Francisco landmarks are about to get some seven-figure facelifts. KPIX5 reporter Simon Perez tells us that the state is spending six and a half million dollars to help boaters, dancers, and dog owners. It doesn't take a bloodhound's nose to sniff out the happy dogs at the Golden Gate Park off-leash play area. Pretty much all of them are. So are their owners. Still, the dog park is due for some upgrades. The state plans to spend $2 million to add more benches, improve the fences, and replace the dusty dirt with doggy turf. Brian Haupty comes with his dog to the park every day. He suggests the state target another spot. The water station needs to be done in a much better way so it drains properly and removes the potential health hazards from all the animals here. This is another one of the projects on the list. It's the public boat dock at Lake Merced. Doesn't look too bad from here, but down at the other end. And it's easy to see this isn't just about cosmetics. This is a safety issue. We tape it off and there's cones too. We tell them not to go there. So what's the point of having a dock if you can't use the whole thing? Exactly. That's why it needs to be fixed. One million state dollars will also help prevent erosion and clean up the trails around the lake. The third project is the Geneva Car Barn, built in 1901 and scheduled to be torn down in 1998. You're in a historic space. This is a 114-year-old roof that's never been fixed. But community passion kept this part of the city's first electric railway system alive. And by the end of next year, 3.5 million state taxpayer dollars will help transform it into a performing arts center. The state funding is on top of $10 million already dedicated to renovate the barn. In San Francisco, I'm Simon Perez, KPIX 5. Some areas of